not me waking up at 6 a.m. just to get those extra snuggles and kisses and go straight back to sleep before Abby leaves. I often hear your morning routine sets the tone of the day, and I do agree. However, let's not forget that your night routine does set the tone of your morning routine. Now, here I was just trying to brush my teeth, wash my face. This is something that I do to wake my body up. It doesn't have to be a cup of coffee immediately I wake up or make my bed because I'm afraid of jumping back into it. Once I brush my teeth, there is no way I'm going back to sleep. No way. Now, fresh air in the morning is something essential. However, we do it only for five minutes. Because than that, it gets really hot. So we keep that for nights. <laughs> you guys but just in case i'll cover her up yeah anyways hubby and sophie just left for work in kindergarten it's quite early my date really starts around eight and i know that could be late for so many people or vice versa 30 35 minutes to eight and i figured i'll just chill like i usually do read my bible something i've been struggling with the last few days for some reason i've been reading my bible like my body soul somewhere else like I don't know if you guys get this but yeah it's something i try to do when i'm struggling to read my bible is i do wash quite a lot i do wash quite a lot it's something that gets me back on track and i feel like it has worked for the last few days because that's what i've been doing and i feel that i should open my bible again thank god also do i journal every single day no the goal is to do it every single day but i trust I, at least i try to do it every other day I'm just also drinking my breastfeeding tea. Anyways, in case you're new here, my name is Paula. I hope you do step by hitting that sub subscribe button down below and become a part of this growing family. And also if you're returning again, thank you so much for your continuous support. Guys, please like, leave a comment. It goes a long way. It really does. And just in case you're wondering, my son is still sleeping. He hasn't woken up officially, but he's about to. So yeah, let me just spend some time pouring in my cup. Summer is almost coming to an end and it still does get bright quite early. And I'm talking about 4 a.m. in the morning, hence the brightness you see right now. And let's not forget about the heat. And once I'm done with my Bible study and journaling, I go straight into making my bed considered the first task of the day but to me first task of the day is literally getting out of bed because can we talk about that A quick plug workout set from Shane got them separate and tell me why I forgot to charge my Apple watch I was literally on 20% <laughs> Lately, I've been trying to teach my daughter how to make her bed and tidy her room, but it's, it's, it's still in progress. But for now, I'm gonna keep doing it until she does master it. Ever since I got cleared after having my second baby, I've been trying to stay consistent and working out for me. I've been trying to kill so many birds using one stone. That's to improve my skin, mood, sleep, most importantly, my mental health. And of course, look good. As a matter of fact, working out for me is among my top three priorities to do list when it comes to my morning routine. Once I'm done showering, it's time for skincare. Guys, I cannot afford to fall off track when it comes to my skincare, considering how my pregnancy showed my skin full limbs. <laughs> Finally, my skin is 
starting to be even guys look at the neck look at the chest Ooh. <laughs> to my breakfast it's not the same anymore i enjoy it but hey i miss my matchas i miss my coffees my lattes but the season i'm in guys doesn't agree with that because caffeine does give babies anxiety and matcha does upset baby's stomach so yeah guys i'm a hot chocolate babe now <laughs> look at the pile of dishes that i had here we did forget to switch on the washing machine the dishwasher the night before so it was busy and look at my night routine already impacting my morning routine. And those little habits of going to bed at a certain time, so you wake up at a certain time, making sure the dishwasher is running, you don't have to wake up to dirty dishes, just like waking up to a calm and clean space. Yeah, but hey, sometimes things happen or life does happen and don't be hard on yourself if you don't get those things done at a certain time frame. So please don't be hard on yourself. Please don't be. <laughs> comes to my son's morning routine there is really nothing hectic it's really just waiting for him to wake up change his diaper as long as he's well fed and changed that's just it guys that's just it look Now, I don't usually wear makeup when I'm at home, as long as my skin is moisturized and prepped like you saw earlier, that's all good. But I have worn makeup on occasional days, however, not this much. But if you want to go ahead and wear makeup well at home, just to boost your confidence and self-esteem and just make yourself look cute, please do it. You know that saying that says, look good, feel good? 100%. Now, because I was going to be meeting up with a friend a little bit later, I decided to use this opportunity to build my face, give myself that extra burst. And I also wanted to say this, guys, all my mornings don't look like this. And they never used to look like this. I used to have slow mornings, light a candle, you know, slow mornings, not anymore. Now I wake up as a mom of two. <laughs> I'm just on the go. But And it's just the season. Anyways, I hope you did get inspired, picked something from this video. Video. I hope you did enjoy it just like that. This was my outfit of the day. So, yeah, guys, I hope you did enjoy it. Don't forget to like, leave a comment, and most importantly, do subscribe. And see you next week on Friday. Bye.